So I went to Hobby Lobby. And um, I've been going to Ho Hobby Lobby because I'm searching for um, a dress form for a girl on YouTube that she messaged me. But um, I'm having a hard time finding it. So I've been getting a lot of other things, but I can't find the particular dress form. So I'll start off with I found some really cute ribbon. And this is um, for um, a package I'm going to put together for um, another swap. And I found these really cute beads I thought I might be able to use on the corsage pins. These were in the clearance section of Hobby Lobby for $1.20. And I got that one, and I got this really pretty one here. And I got these really pretty ones too. And I really like them, so if I end up, if they don't work on the pins, I'll just probably use them, you know, like as charms or something. And I just got all kinds of little stuff, and... Again, the only thing I was looking for in particular was the dress form, and I couldn't find it. So I ended up just getting different things, thinking of, you know, different packages I'm putting together, and and um, some giveaways that I'm going to be doing. So I really, I got this cute little uh, vintage charm. These are in the clearance section. Now, the last time I got them, they were on sale. I mean, which is roughly the, the same price as being in the clearance section. But I just thought that was so cute. It is so tiny, too. So I got quite a few of these charms. There's another of the turtle. I got this really cute little um, little square, but it has, like, um, very decorative. Very cute. Love the colors. I love that these vintage colors, and I love this one. This one is so cute. It's very ornate, and with the little flowers, and very pretty. Um... And then I got this uh, 4th of July ribbon for my 4th of July giveaway. And I've been seeing on YouTube people talking about these flowers, or these leaves, and I finally found them. Because I do not own any Prima leaves. I just um, never, I guess, picked them up when they were on sale or clearance, never saw them. So these were only $0.77, cents, and you get quite a few... So, you know, just glimmer missed them, you know, and then they'd be just kind of like the Prima Lees. And I got two packs of those. And then I got some other bling. I got these really shimmery and pretty ones. I love that. I got some, um, just regular bling. I saw these star ones and I was like, oh my god, these are perfect for that, um, giveaway. I mean, and I found some really good stuff at Hobby Lobby for the giveaway. Not as anywhere near as much um, as I wanted to get, but I think I I think I might be okay. I actually found a hard time finding paper. I don't know why paper were so difficult. I love these pearls. I got the big pearls in my the the haul I did on uh, Monday, so I got these little cute little tiny ones that I haven't got. And then, um, I got these white shimmery ones. I cannot wait to put this, um, 4th of July kit together. You guys are gonna love it. And, then um, that video should be following all of my haul videos. I'll put that one up. Look how cute that is. So pretty. And then I got this, um, this red one. So a lot of the stuff that you see that's, uh, you know, red, white, and blue is more than likely for... For that um, giveaway, got another one of those. I got these camping ones for a uh, for a package I'm doing right now, and these ones as well. Here's some teeny, teeny little tiny pearls. These ones are really little, very cute. And then um, I got these ones. These are just for a package I'm doing. And they did have this really cute paper. So I thought that was perfect for 4th of July in the seasonal section. And I think it was 40% off. Um, I got another one of these blings. And these were in the seasonal section. So I got that bling. I got one that says USA. Um, let's see here. And then I got um, a star. I got these doilies. These were actually in the um, like baking section. 
really cute and they're really small. I don't have any small doilies. Um, I got these alley cat um, buttons. I got these vintage buttons. I believe I got two packs of those vintage buttons, but I don't see the other one. Um, I got some of these little letter stickers. That's actually... There you go. They were upside down. Um, and then I got these ones as well. And then I got some more of those um, Doodlebug design buttons. Just the Christmas ones, because I love the Christmas ones. Those are my favorite. Get another one of those cute little turtles. Um, I get this one because I'm doing a, a vintage um, kit for a swap. I thought that would be perfect. Got this cute stamp. I love this stamp. I love stamps like that. Um, I got this really cute 4th of July stamp. How cute is that? And then I got um, this really pretty um, butterfly stamp. I really like that one. And then I got some more of the red bling, um, some more of the the vintage. Here's the other um, nostalgic treasures buttons. Got these really cute little um, like it says tiny bugs buttons. Um, I got a big pack of the of the pins, and they're a little bit cheaper at Hobby Lobby, so I picked them up. And then I got some of this. Um, Star bling. So I'm gonna pick out the you know the red, white, and blue ones, and these were in clearance for $1.24. Um, this was in the clearance section, and I love this. I think this is gorgeous. Just the color of the metal. I mean, it's really cute, and it was $2.51 in the clearance. Um, I picked up some fibers. Really cute. Picked up these. I love these. These are adorable. Like the little like trim, so cute. Um, I picked up, uh, I took it out of the package just to you know look at it and test it. But I picked up some of the zig glue, two way glue. I picked that up to do um, like to restick my um, Cricut mat. I've been watching some tutorials on that, and I have a an older Cricut mat that uh, it's not quite as sticky anymore. And then I found this in the seasonal section. It's swirl glitter glue. Perfect for that swap or that uh, giveaway package. Love, love that. Um, picked up this ribbon here. Yeah, it, it is going to be a pretty big um, giveaway. It's the first giveaway I'm gonna ever that I've ever done, so it's gonna be a little bit bigger because I'm so excited. And then I picked up this, and this is just really, really cool. And I picked it up in the blue. Very fun. And then I picked up some more Copic markers. Um, I tried to make sure that I just went completely with colors that I didn't already get. Hoping that I wouldn't duplicate any because they're not cheap. And I got the Cardinal, the Lettuce Green, and the Powder Pink. And then I got... Um, waiting for the camera to focus. Uh, Brick Beige. Um, pale lilac and blue violet and again I'm gonna go over the 10 minutes I just hope it downloads anyway um, I got the skin white fruit pink which I think I might have gotten fruit pink already the um what's that ultramarine yellow yellowish skin pink and abyss green that one sounds familiar. I might have gotten that one already too. Um, and then I just got a couple sheets of the 12x12 12 12 pattern paper. It's not on sale and I didn't want to wait until it was on sale for 4th of July. Um, so I just got like three sheets. I got this really pretty one and this one was actually um, on clearance at uh, Hobby Lobby. Oh, I'm... The paper's not going to be on sale for 4th of July. I was thinking about Joann's, but um, this one was 21 cents, and I really, really liked it. And then I got this one for the 4th of July kit, and then I got this one for a swap for um, somebody because it's horses, and um, their kids are really into horses. So that's my uh, Hobby Lobby haul, and I, again, hope this will download because it's, like, somewhat over 11 minutes. Um, thanks for watching. Happy scrapping, and bye!